Gladys and I got married in uh, 2012. And uh, a year into our marriage, we decided to try to have children. Unfortunately, by 2014, we were still unable to conceive. Our worst fears were confirmed when eventually we sought consult with a rheumatologist who diagnosed her with lupus. So the first thing that came to my mind is, can I have children? Can we have our own kids? I really asked God, why me? Did I do anything wrong? I mean, God has been really gracious to me and He's been healing me through the months. So after about... About, about one year. year. Yeah. yeah, so um, the rheumatologist actually gave us the green light because her condition was stable enough to actually uh, try to conceive. So I was uh, really grateful during that period of time to God for His protection over Gladys. And uh, towards the end of 2015, uh, we were overjoyed to hear the news that uh, she was uh, pregnant. Yeah, so I thought, oh, finally, uh, I'm pregnant. And um, it's really a miracle at that point, yeah. Um, but at about, uh, at the second uh, visit to the doctor, um, it was announced that the baby, there was no heartbeat. Yeah, so... <laughs> it was pretty devastating at that point, yeah. So during this period of time, um, we had many fears and worries. But during um, these dark days, we actually grew closer to one another. Uh, we drew closer to God as well. His presence was constant, was always reassuring. And there was a sense of peace and uh, calm, uh, and uh, which actually dispelled most of our fears. So after about one year, we managed to conceive our second child. Oh, but the pregnancy wasn't easy. So initially, there's a lot of nausea, vomiting. And at the early stage of pregnancy, I even had spotting, which is very fearful because I had miscarriage before. I was very, very scared. The same feeling of the first miscarriage came back. The second problem is that um, our child's weight is very low. It was only 1.5 kg. So the first thing that we did, I actually went to the healing room and to ask God for healing. So at the end, I actually gave birth to my son at a targeted weight of 2.5 kg. And we named him Raphael, which is inspired by God, who is our Jehovah Rapha, the healer. Uh, it's been an amazing faith journey. Um, through it all, I think we've learned that, yes, God is sovereign, but He is also faithful. Um, through all the valleys that we've gone through, He was there with us, walking alongside us. I've learned to trust Him in small or big things and it has been really a journey of faith.